Welcome back to the channel, guys. My name is Gordon. We are back with another video. Today, we're talking about Tau as the opportunity of a lifetime. As always, if you enjoy the content, please make sure to smash that thumbs up button below. Hit subscribe, hit that bell notification icon. We're on the road to 100,000 subscribers. So get along for the journey and make sure to grab your free copy of the Rise of Bitcoin in the description. Grab it below and let's talk about Tau. Very quickly, guys, before we get into it, we are doing a one Tau giveaway on the channel here. All you have to do to be in with a chance to win that one Tau is you must be subscribed down below. So make sure to subscribe and you have to drop a comment below this video of your favorite subnet. The winner will be announced on Christmas Day, just a couple days. So make sure to comment below this video right now and let's get into it. Hey guys, I want to talk about BitTensor Tau as the opportunity of a lifetime. I want to talk about the bull case here for BitTensor Tau because we've just come through the first ever BitTensor halving event and now the emission rewards have been halved on a daily basis. I just created this post last week on X. If you're not following me on X, make sure to jump over and give it a follow. I'm posting content every single day about BitTensor, about the markets and very frequent updates, but <clears throat> effectively now that we've had the first bit tensor having, we have 50% less tau entering circulation every single day. Now, historically, when we've seen similar halving events with Bitcoin, it does take six to 12 months for the effects of the halving to fully play out. And I don't think BitTensor will be an exception. I do think we're not going to see major effects taking place until we have another few months of price action here. But effectively, what this means is competition is increasing and subnets are having to compete for less emissions. So again, we're going to be seeing the evolution of BitTensor now that we've had its first halving event. And I've been on the record discussing everything about subnets, giving updates on all the emissions, et cetera, et cetera. And my bull case for BitTensor still remains that I think we can be seeing prices getting to, you know, thirty to fifty thousand dollars in the timeline where we get to about twenty thirty two. So again, looking at this from a very long term perspective, there is still <clears throat> very much a bullish case intact as we look outwards for the next five to seven years. But BitTensor has a key problem. And one of those problems is the fact that it is <clears throat> the only major layer one without a marketing budget. And this is where BitCast comes in because BitCast is one of the main, if not the only marketing subnet on the BitTensor network. And effectively what BitCast is doing is it is um, ultimately connecting brands with creators. And this video you're watching right now is an example of that, guys. I've been talking about BitCast a lot on the channel lately but effectively connecting brands with creators using the incentive mechanism of the BitTensor network to ultimately allow creators to earn Tau for creating videos on content around specific brands. So ultimately creating this new um, AI powered Web3 influencer um, marketplace, and it makes it so seamless for creators and for brands to execute <clears throat> and create content not just around BitTensor subnets, but around any type of business that wants promotion. So very exciting stuff happening with BitCast and BitCast can help BitTensor ultimately get to that next level because with other layer one blockchains like Ethereum and with Solana, you've got their foundations. They have huge marketing budgets that they spend, but BitCast and BitTensor is relying on the incentive mechanism that is inherent to the network to incentivize creators to push out campaigns just like this video and connecting them with brands to ultimately get huge amounts of reach, much more so than they could with centralized campaigns for all of the marketing budget that they have. So the BitCast YouTube vision has been in full flight and execution here over the past number of months. Lots of creators on board, hundreds of creators across both YouTube and X at this point in time. And Bit, BitCast are only continuing to level up everything they're doing on YouTube and with the rollout of X as well. So very interesting stuff happening on BitCast. I'm going to leave a link to BitCast Network in the video description below for you guys to check it out. Obviously, if you are a creator, you can get on board, start mining and earning Tau. And if you're a brand, you can ultimately reach hundreds of thousands, if not millions of 
um, subscribers once BitCast continues to onboard more people with your campaigns. So get in touch with BitCast if you want to run something like that. But the very uh, powerful component of BitCast, again, going back to this post from Taustacker, full shout out to this guy on X, he put together a super concise summary of the sustainable tokenomics that bit that bit bitcast has because ultimately you know this flywheel is already in effect and it's only set to get more powerful because when brands spend money on campaigns then that revenue is used to purchase back the bitcast alpha those tokens then get burned which creates even more scarcity content improves from the creators over time which means brands spend more because they're able to get more reach for less dollars especially compared to centralized campaigns so this sustainable tokenomic structure is what makes the bitcast flywheel so powerful and in my opinion, that is only set to continue and get even more powerful with the amount of stuff that BitCast has in the pipeline, consistent briefs, new clients, and also expanding outside of the BitTensor ecosystem. So very uh, powerful structure with the sustainable tokenomics and the BitCast YouTube vision that they keep building upon. And so BitCast... Um, Marketing is essentially revving up now that the BitTensor halving is happening, and we've just had that first halving event play out. So I'm very excited to see how BitCast will continue to contribute and rev up their marketing efforts now that the first halving has taken place. And just to bring it back to that opportunity of a lifetime, because I don't think I can speak too much on this. And, you know, I wake up every day and I see the price of BitTensor currently at $230, and I'm kind of wondering, like, I get the opportunity to keep purchasing this asset. I'm either completely wrong, and that could be the case. I am either completely incorrect, and we're going to see bit um, the bit tensor price go, you know, to twenty dollars and go to zero. Okay, I'm either completely wrong, or this asset has the potential to be a $1 trillion asset and go into the thousands, if not the tens of thousands of dollars in price with the structure of the subnets being AI startups, with the AI revolution being possibly one of the biggest revolutions of our lifetime. You need to check out the other videos on my channel if you're interested in this, guys, because ultimately what we've seen with Bit coin is we've seen Bitcoin follow Metcalf's law over the past 16, 17 years with a V equals N squared structure. Um, Reed's law is what BitTensor has the potential to follow because of the subnet architecture and the fact that it is a network of networks, it could grow even more exponentially with V equals two to the N, which effectively means you're going to see the growth of BitTensor playing out more in a um, hockey stick type curve versus Metcalf's law, which Bitcoin has followed. And Bitcoin has obviously grown very aggressively to a $2 trillion market cap over the past 17 years. But effectively, if BitTensor is going to follow Reed's law, it would get to a $1 trillion market cap faster than Bitcoin. And again, I've spoken about this. Shout out to Mike from Contango. I interviewed him just last week on the channel. So check that out as well. But he had a fantastic presentation breaking down the fact that if BitTensor has the potential to reach $1 trillion in market cap before Bitcoin, we could see that happening by the year 2031, which is going to put the Bit tensor tau price somewhere around 60,000 US dollars by that time. I know it sounds crazy when the price of the asset right now is $230, but with that Reed's Law network effect playing out over the next five to seven years, I think it's very, very possible. All we need to see is one of these subnets going mainstream. You've got ridges, you've got uh, shoots, you've got bitcast. And again, I think these subnets have the potential to be giants in the space. And I'm super excited to see how all those subnets, especially BitCast, continue to grow and evolve here over the coming months and years. So BitCast is positioned to help BitTensor from a marketing perspective, revving up marketing efforts now that we've had that first halving event. The first halving event, um, you know, being very bullish for the ecosystem, in my opinion, but it's going to take six to 12 um, months for all of that to play out. Um, being the only layer one without that marketing budget means we need subnets like BitTensor, uh, sorry, like BitCast to keep spreading the word with creators, uh, getting Tau and the ecosystem and subnets in front of more investors. The asymmetric once in a lifetime opportunity, I don't think can be understated or overstated, I should say. And, you know, like I said, I wake up every day with the potential to buy 
bit tensor token at $230. I think it's going to be fascinating by the time we get to the second bit tensor having to look back somewhere here by the time we're in 2029 when we have that second having and think about where price has got to, how the ecosystem has evolved, and how much growth we've seen. And I do think Bitcast can help BitTensor get there. That is it for today's video, guys. As always, if you got any value out of this breakdown for the opportunity of a lifetime for BitTensor, please make sure to smash that thumbs up button below. Make sure to comment your favorite subnet in the comments below to be in with a chance to win that one Tau token. Make sure to subscribe. We're on the road to 100K subscribers and grab your free gift in the description. It's waiting for you down below the rise of Bitcoin and we'll catch you in the next one. Thank <laughs> you.